is Fashion Week in Toronto. Everywhere you look, there are buyers and sellers and designers and, of course, supermodels. It is a very sexy time to be in the big city. Now, you could fill a warehouse with what I don't know about fashion, and not just any warehouse, Mark's Work Warehouse, which is why I have with me tonight my secret weapon, my guide to the pretty life, the one and only from fashion television, Jeannie Becker. Hello, Jeannie. Hello, darling. Mwah, mwah. Mwah, mwah. Mwah, mwah. No, no, only twice. Oh. One on each cheek. And you don't have to have physical contact with the cheek. You know? I've already it's blown it. Air. Okay, once again. <laughs> Mwah, mwah. Fashion week, here we come. What can we expect? We can expect a celebration of Canadian fashion, yes. of course. This is a week-long shot at putting great Canadian style on the runway. On the runway. And everyone's very happy, and, and we're, we're proudly waving the flag because it's all about Canada. And uh, are you wearing Canadian? Yes, Stanfield underwear. This door has your name on it. Yes, a bit of a stretch. <laughs> ah, listen, it's gonna happen sooner than you think. There's Canada's next top model. This... That's Megan. Yeah, she won that big competition. Oh, I see. You're Canada's next top model? I am. So you are Canada's top model. I guess. So. You won the contest. I did. You're a star, sweetie. So proud of you. So proud of you. And this is Rick Mercer. Hello, how are you? How are you? I turned Mrs. Harper on to Andy Tian, and okay. she wore Andy's dress to the National Art Center Gala a oh, few weeks ago. Laureen mm. Harper. Yes. Right. Did you dress John Beard as well? Not yet. <laughs> Look, her bum. Oh, this is yes, actually this happening. This actually going on. There. In there. Look, right oh, in there. Look in there. there. Let's go in there. Now, he probably does <laughs> what they call the stomach crunches. <laughs> I meant to do a stomach crunch before I came here. Red turns me on. Ooh. Do you have colors that turn you on? you're Canadian. Well, red has always turned me on. Really? Yeah. Well, it's a very powerful color. Yeah. Well, that shirt doesn't fit. <laughs> Those shorts are leather. Red leather shorts. See, I'd be worried about chafing. I've never seen a black leather back before. I'm so excited we're sitting in the front row at a fashion show. I know, it's a trip. Your first fashion show. I don't think this happens to everybody. I don't know what to say about that. If that was a good one to break you in with or not. But well, how did it strike you? How did it grab you? Well, see, I don't what want to, did it say, I don't to you? say anything bad because oh. I know there's people who would love to wear that. I've yeah. never met them or seen them. Right. But <laughs> they must be out there. Not right? your cup of tea, in well, other words. I don't have the body for it. Uh. Now, I have to be in a show. Yeah. So don't think it's easy because no. it's not. You, okay, you are concerned? Rightly yes. so. You know what? I'm going to team you up with a runway coach. That's a job? Some, yeah, it's a job. Some people do it full time. Okay, and I'm standing here with Norwayne Anderson. Hello, Norwayne. How are you? Hello, How nice are you? to see you. <laughs> Jeannie Becker tells me you are the runway coach. Uh, well, I can do my best for you. Yes, yeah. you're the best, I hear. I am the best. Okay. <laughs> I can walk and talk. Oh, oh yeah. That's, that's what good. I do. <laughs> I can do that. Let's not try to talk. <laughs> let's just try to get you No, let's just get you from point A to point B. Okay. You want us to tell, convey a, a message. I want to tell a story you with my eyes. Story, yes. Without actually saying it. Why don't I just tell a story? No. I'm a story weaver. Okay, we're not going to go there. No. Let's, let's get to the point I know that we need to, for you to tell a story without okay. actually speaking. And the story is, the story you is want me. Yeah, ah, you got it. So you're here, yeah. you hold it, step away. I am in The Bustle Show uh -huh. by Sean Hewson. Good show to be in. He's around the corner. Hi, how are you? Good, how are I'm you? Rick. I'm Sean. Hi, Sean. Nice to see you. Yeah, you too. So, Sean Houston, I'm, I'm going to be wearing yeah. your clothes. You are. This is my wife, Ruth. Hi, Hi. nice to see you. This. I've been with Jeannie Becker today, and I've Love learned it. a few things. So I want to know, what is, the, what is the philosophy behind this line that we're going to see tonight? What's the theme? Um, that was pretty good, wasn't it? That was good. That was good. good. <laughs> what will I be wearing? Uh, where's Rick's outfit? Okay. Oh, this look is at that. Huh? Oh, wow, Online. that's me, isn't it? It is. Okay. So how did 
does this I feel? I don't know when to go on. What do you mean? Yes, someone's gonna push you. Don't worry. Don't worry. let you know when to go on. No, but I have to be out there at the beginning, and then oh, I have to move. You're opening the show. No, no. Okay. I'm behind the barbecue. So They've decided to put me someone. behind the barbecue. I'm hidden from here. It's like a oh, puppet show. My head is barbecue. sticking out. I, I know. There's a, I don't. Okay. I think so it's to hide my body. Oh, now you're getting insecure at the last minute. Figures like all divas do. Do my thighs look big? All right. <laughs> Does this jacket make my butt look big? No. I shouldn't have eaten that apple today. I know. What is your attitude going to be walking down the runway? I don't What's know. your focus? Fear. Not supposed to talk to the model. Officially the strangest thing I've ever done.